You're watching your best friend, Crystal J. What's that you wearing? You wearing? That fit you wearing? You wearing? You got a limo in Cali and say every time you walk by, it's a more, a lot, a more. What's up, YouTube? It's your best friend, Crystal J, and I'm back with another dope ass video branding. So let's get into it. So let's say you're like me, you have a business and you pretty much you let's say you let's say you ha you have an old flyer that you like like me personally and you just need to update your branding well today we're using pink monkey okay you guys and i'm about to get ready to it so i'm gonna edit a copy Let's see how this goes So you guys, this actually isn't the full flyer. Hey, okay, it's a little bit different, but this uh, was designed two years ago, maybe three years ago. My brand is black and white, and we're about to work on it now. What I'm about to do is change. I'm just gonna delete certain things off of here. Cause I'm about to do it a different way. So type in now. You know my branding has changed. So my thing is hey baddie. Hey baddies. So, so that is the so the font I'm going to use. Actually, uh, gonna be the same font from then. Can I tell you, I loved my old my old flyer back then. Um, I just have to change it a little bit up because it's not my brand no more. It don't match my colors. I'm not. My color used to be pink, but pink is so in your face. And you have some people that just won't shop with you because of your color. So, you know, black and white is a little bit more subtle. A little bit, it's a little bit more easier, you know. So, my shop, that was not the fun I originally had. My font for my branding is always, this is simple, is clean. I just need to go back to graphics. Go back to graphics. Go to basic. And back pay attention. All my flyers have one thing in common: the white on the bottom with my look, with my website. I mean, like, what? Am I adding my Instagram to this? Cause I literally have a what? If you guessed it, you've been watching my channel too much. I have a QR code. And I believe I believe my QR code is important for my flyer as well. Anyway, we're gonna go to text. You will most definitely have to add your website. My is www.aboragore.com. When you create your your company, your branding package, you guys should know your S code. On top of your S code, you should know your fonts. Um, I will share that video. Um, next. You should know, and I will go in way into depth, and that video will be a little bit longer. But you should know your head codes, your fonts. This is important to know. Because think about it. Why would you not know that? And I just did a little on uh, spacing.
bring this into Pig Monkey. Because Pig Monkey have certain elements that I really enjoy. Right here, you're gonna see that I'm gonna change my mind and I'm gonna actually use a picture of my model. Uh, so, when you're designing your pliers or you're rebranding your pliers or whatever the case you may be doing, sometimes it's okay. Not sometimes, it is okay to play with it, change out the picture to see which one fits your brand a little bit more. For me, it was more of her who've um, fitted a lot better so I end up using Canva because Canva has an element that I love and the element on Canva is um, the phone element and the phone element in, in Canva actually I'm using pick monkey right here but I end up going to Canva to use the picture um, the phone element and the phone element for me was very important. If you pay attention to my branding closely, you notice I always use the phone from Canva. So I end up designing my flyer in Pick Monkey, but I end up finishing my flyer in Canva, which you're gonna see in the rest of this video. I, I, may, I mainly did this in pick monkey, you guys. Like, the only thing I did different was just add that. So now I'm gonna go back to pick monkey. So you see, I used a little bit of both pick monkey and Canva. Uh, Canva was my finishing touches. But if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel, Amora Lore. And please go support me and shop at www.amoralore.com. On the front flyer, all you see that I did was change a little bit. And the only thing I literally did was add the QRZ code, which is very important. But don't forget to subscribe to my channel here at Amora Lore. Bye, you guys. See you next Monday at 1.30.